So now we need to clean up after using our painting studio. Painting can be a little bit messy, so it's really important that we do a good job cleaning so it's ready to go for our next So first thing when you're painting is you need to make sure your name is on your artwork and you're going to put it on the drying rack. I know mine is blank. Let's pretend there's a beautiful painting masterpiece on it. Um, you're gonna put it on the drying rack, making sure it's under the right class name. And then you are going to start taking your painting supplies back to the painting studio. So I'm gonna pick these up. We're gonna walk over to the painting studio. Okay, here we are. After you have your supplies at the painting studio, you need to put them back where they belong. So I'm gonna put my placemat back in the stack. I'm gonna take my paint tray and I'm gonna put it back where it belongs. So I'm gonna look for the labels. I know these are watercolors. Yep, watercolors. They go right there. Temper cakes can go back there. If you have paint markers, you can put them back in the basket. Tempera cups, paint cups, make sure you open the drawer and put them back in the right side up. Okay, so I put away my placemat, I put away my paint. Now, any brushes or tools that you use, we do not want to put them back in the supplies because they are probably dirty. Even if they look clean, even if you've rinsed them out, I do not want you to put them back in the cups. Okay, I need you to walk over to the sink and we have something called our brush bath. So we have this bowl that looks like a watermelon. This is our brush bath. So I'm gonna take my brushes and I'm just gonna put them in the water with their hair down and they're gonna soak in there and Mrs. King will wash them out later, okay? Um, if you have tools like sponges or rollers, I do need you to rinse these out, okay? So rinse them out, squeeze all the water out, and then we have drying racks right here. Right now it's kinda covered in painting bowls. Uh, but what you're gonna do with your tool, either your sponge, your scraper, or your roller, is you're gonna rinse it off, squeeze all the water out, and then I want you just to set it on top of the drying rack. And it'll dry, and Mrs. King will put it back on the shelf later. Okay, um, water bowl, same thing. Make sure you dump out the water, and then you can put it on the drying rack to dry. Remember, our painting studio should always look like this at the end of cleanup, everything where it belongs placemats put away, art on the drying rack, our dirty brushes in the brush bath, and any tools or water bowls on the drying rack. Okay, if we show greatness during cleanup for the painting studio, it'll be ready to go for our next class.